got a prince who's handsome, brave and strong. Write a poem about a man whose nose is 12 feet long. When you write, you can tell the world how you feel inside. When you write a story or a poem, imagination takes you for a About a cat and dog who always fight Write a poem about your big sister Who thinks she's always right When you write, you can tell the world How you feel inside When you write a story or when a poem write a story or a poem Imagination takes you This is Jeff Richmond, who is a Hi. good old buddy of mine from 89, it was, when we first... 1989, August. Uh, yeah, August of 89. Uh -huh. And uh, here we are, yeah. uh, going to give the Victor Award to Jeff, and uh, why the Victor Award? Victor Panagrosi passed away in 1995, and about a year later, we wanted to honor his memory and give the award to people that had the same kind of love for child's play and were very uh, excellent and striving for excellence, which was uh, Victor's other side of him. It was always excellent, it's got to be excellent. And uh, Jeff, of course, embodies both of those things uh, to the hilt. <laughs> uh, Jeff's legacy at child's play is uh, so multifaceted. He is a truly a renaissance man. Oh no! The lobby again! <laughs> Here's two dollars for my fellow man. Just please stay out of that garbage can. No, I, I can't take your money, son. No, no, really. Here, please. Take it. Well, um... Thank you, young man. That's a nice thing to do. And had you know, raised the bar so high as far as the music direction was concerned, it was very difficult to find. And we had amazing, talented music directors come through. And Jeff uh, helped to create the song that we use now as our theme song, Stories and Poems. sung probably to four million people during the course of the last couple of decades. Jeff's legacy is also in the visual side of what we did. He did these beautiful masks for our WOW program. To the coasts of Tanzania! I'm gonna catch you, cheetah! You'll never catch me, slowpoke! That we used throughout. And the drops. We had a bevy of uh, visual backdrops, and between him and Michael Thomas, they left quite a legacy, uh, working together hand-to-hand -hand while they were there, and then Jeff's beautiful brush of so many different backdrops that we still use and touch up to this day, <laughs> if you can believe it. So his legacy is in so many different aspects. He even did our uh, graphic design uh, for our brochures that yeah. we did so back in that day too. It was like, what doesn't Jeff do? Good lord. Did, yeah. you, did you pay me enough? Because that sounds like I did a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I did a lot of no, we definitely, we definitely didn't job. pay you enough. Um, sorry, I interrupted you. So <laughs> no, you're doing no, such no, a it's great brilliant. Out there. It's brilliant. But, and that is the other thing. <laughs> his unbelievable timing, his wit that, you know, it made Jeff Jeff. You know, it's like, I think that's why Victor loved you so much, because the two of you had this unbelievable wit, and it was like when you were together, it was just magical. <laughs> And uh, yeah, he really loved you, my like oh, brother. That's very yeah. And I want to, at this moment, uh, take this opportunity to bring out the Victor Award that is actually made in uh, the same place where they make the Oscars, RSO, and I'm going to give them a little plug, they'll be happy. And uh, I want to just say, muchas gracias, Senor, and thank you so much. Oh, thank you very much. 
all the the legacy that you've you've left for Child's Play oh. that continues to live That's beyond <sighs> your being. There. Oh, thank you, June, very much. Mm. I, I really, really appreciate this, and I'm, I'm really flattered, and uh, uh, I can't say enough about uh, how honored I am to actually receive this award. It uh, it does mean a lot to me, and Victor. Uh, I will. I think about very fondly, and uh, to this day, and uh, yeah, it, it does. It, it's, it's very nice to get this. Um, uh, yeah, it's made by the same company that makes the Oscar. Yes, so. absolutely. <laughs> That's good. So I kind of have an Oscar. You kind of yeah. have an Oscar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a Victor. That's very nice. A, it's a Vasca. That's great. It's a Vasca award. <laughs> Fantastic. Um, Yes, and I, so I want to thank you, and I want to thank Child's Play Touring, uh, Touring Theater, and uh, and everybody involved, and, and thank you very, very much. I'm very, I'm very honored. Oh, thank you, mm. and I wish you could come if you can. You know, you're always welcome. If yeah. I'm there right yeah. now, yeah. turn around, everybody, turn around to the <laughs> turn around to the back of the theater, cause. Uh -huh. Use that if I show up. Oh, yeah. Because then there we'll you turn go. around. I'll be there. That's yeah, yeah, perfect. Yeah, Brilliant. Yeah, good stuff. So he's thinking ahead. <laughs> but, or use it or don't. Okay. Then everybody will turn around and be like, uh, what happened? <laughs> it's not there anyway. <laughs> I'll just start with some of the things that I remember about Victor. Uh, I thought he, he was very um, generous and loving and kind and warm and very, very professional person. And, he, and kind. Mostly kind mm -hmm. is one thing that I'll always think about Victor. Yeah. Kind to the people he worked with. Uh, kind to his uh, to the other actors i think he really had a genuine affection for people who were who had had talent and mm -hmm. uh, uh, and and who were fun who were funny and yeah. you could you could feel that when you were around him and also a kind person to uh, to the children he, he cared he cared about how, how those kids what they thought and what you were doing for them and they cared about the program well maybe he doesn't have to buy it but it's a and uh, he was just a very, very nice, warm person. He loved Child's Play, and he loved, <coughs> loved what he did, and, and, and you could tell, and he was the best, best one at it. Howdy! He was the best one at it. You know, you would be struggling with trying, how are we gonna put this thing on its feet, da 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 and he would just come in and, and look at it and just be able to do it at a drop of a hat. He just yeah. had that skill. I am going to quit my job and follow my secret dream. It is to be a chicken farmer. A what? Yeah. The rest of us would wrestle around with, oh, what's the overbearing conceit? Is it like, <laughs> is it like Gone with the Wind? Should we make this, you know, it's a, it's a fox and a, it's a fox and a hen. <laughs> Oh, and the one, they're, they're supposed to be friends, and the other one talking, you know, and the, the grapes were, I don't know. Anyway, and so we'd be sitting around, we'd go like, what is it, can we do, is it gone with the wind? Can we put some kind of, you know, play terrorist theme? George, can you play that on the piano? We get like, gone, I don't know. But my point oh, being George, is that we would yeah. like, you know, break our backs trying to make it something Art. that the weight of a children's yeah. story is going to crumble. But Victor knew exactly how much Gone with the Wind to put, <laughs> to put into it. it. Yeah. And then it crumbled. The rest of us were be like, gone. Yeah. And then be gone. Yeah. Make it easier than you're doing. Right, exactly. Very good at that. Yeah. Uh, and so he would, very uh, was very good at that. Uh, which, which I actually took on later, you know, with things that you remember. Like, mm -hmm. it doesn't have to be. If it's, you don't need to put mm -hmm. all that weight on something that's right. this big, you know. It's, it's nice. So we were trying to cast the uh, the Christmas that almost wasn't as a guy named Adam McKay, Adam McKay. who has since gone on is yeah. still a friend yeah, uh, right. Second City yeah. yeah and he's still uh, he him. liked Victor so much and he's like you know Will Ferrell and him have a big yeah. a big movie yeah. company he wrote Anchorman yeah I said I I know this guy's really funny he's really big he could play Santa Claus and Victor said well I'll bring him in <laughs> to watch Victor watch Adam McKay do Santa Claus <laughs> yeah. was pretty. Uh, enjoyable. Yeah. yeah, he he thought he was like an unbelievable. He part. was, he yeah, is, and yeah, and, yeah. So, and Victor and Victor can you know <laughs> you can spot that. You yeah, know, you know, he did. Know that he had thing. a great eye for talent. Victor. Yeah, he did. He knew. He knew how to cast. He cast me. And the fire that burned inside me. Hey, I remember that audition too. I, we showed oh, up with it. By the me. way, so Child's Play also is the thing that got me to Chicago from uh, you know, oh, leaving school in Ohio. Right. It was my first job, and yeah. I had this job. And I didn't know if I had it till I showed up. 
Wow. I moved there. And, wow. And uh, I had to go to the theater building. Didn't know if I could play the piano or not, I think was the thing. And so yeah. I could I played the piano for Victor and Michael Thomas. That guy Michael sure thought he Thomas. was something. <laughs> what did I do? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Write songs and yeah. Yeah, Lima like that. Beans is Victor's brother's favorite song. Is that right? And we have to bring it back. Lima Beans! <laughs> Bring it back. It's a good money one. for me, I think. <laughs> if I remember, I think I get, I think I get, I think I own a piece of lima beans somewhere. So, uh, but you know what? Don't worry about it. Put it back in the fund. <laughs> okay. Got it. Whatever but that royalty is. It's lima beans, actually. It's lima beans. Oh, yeah, it's right, lima right. Beans it's basically lime. lima beans. Yeah. Oh yeah, my wife the, worked there too. Yeah. Uh, yeah my wife, Tina, Tina Fey. She worked at the time going into classrooms and stuff, yeah. right? Going yeah, into the educational as an artist. Yeah. yeah, right, right, right. So she was there. Put that on a wall somewhere. Yeah, she was. Uh, uh, that was a tough job for She's anybody to go in. She, right. You know, and, uh, I wish we were here. I wish we were there once again. <laughs> um, <laughs> we're in New York for a, a special reason. Doing the Thirty Rock. Is Thirty Rock. Yeah. Seven years. Right now. Wow. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you very on much. That one. That's. No, you know, now that you are a parent, uh -huh, you know, right, why, do you, right. why do you think child's play is important? Because I think that schools need that additional thing. The funding for the arts programs mm -hmm. are not they're not as prevalent as they used to be. And what I know about? people who are teachers, and I think that child's play provides uh, th this other missing ele element of inspirational, fun, ownership, and, and mm -hmm. teaching... Uh, uh, teaching these um, building blocks of writing stories, mm -hmm. I think, uh, is very important to them. I don't think they get right. that. Uh, it's literacy. But your imaginations will never be as good as they are at the age as you are now. And what a better way to uh, use your imagination than writing your own stories? Once upon a time in. Yeah. It's literacy. Yeah. It's the other side of literacy. Everybody right. says read, read, read. Right. You have to write. And you have to yeah. write. Right. It's, like it's the other side of literacy. If nobody's writing, then right. there's nothing to nothing read. To read. <laughs> exactly. Case closed. <laughs> I know. <laughs> the prosecution rests. <laughs> what I, I wish Child's Play uh, to continue with the great success that they have, they've always had and to continue with the excellence they have. And I, I wish them uh, all the support that they could possibly get because they deserve every penny of it. And every, not just penny, not just monetary, just every ounce, every hug, <laughs> yeah, every can work, of soup. You know? Yeah, and they want to work. And it's, uh, <laughs> and it's very, very important work. Uh, so I wish them continued, continued success. Aww. All right. Thank you Thank so you. much for making Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Oh, this you're welcome. Was such a, a wonderful great. treat to catch up. You write a story when you write a story.